Aramee tried to kill Yaakov Avinu. So we got a Yaakov Avinu, but when he came out 20 years later from Gullis, he came out with 12 boys. The tribes, the ones that went to get the Torah, which was coming up at Mount Sinai. He came out with 12 boys. He came out He came out with money. He came out with flocks. He came out with everything. But the one thing he came out with when he met his brother, he said, I need Gautiam Laban. I, I dwelt with that swindler. I lived with him for 20 years. I need Gauti. And then before she tells us, she tells us that I need Gauti. Gauti means the 13 Tariyak mitzvahs. I kept all 613 mitzvahs in Gullahs. And I came out of Gullahs and I still living in there. I came and I did all the mitzvahs and I still prospered. And I knew I was in Gullahs. And I knew I was going to, uh, to work. Come out of the mikvah, and I was going to go to work, and I was going to work in 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 in, in the world, and I, and I wanted to keep all the mitzvahs. So I said, I need the strength of Yaakov Avinu, and I knew by this, you know, I was searching and searching all those years. Torah's emes, we have the truth, we have the emes. So I Yaakov Avinu's emes. So I take the name Yaakov, and I said, I'm taking the name Yaakov. And then when I heard the teachings about Ephraim, Ephraim who was born in Mitzrayim, not connected to his great grandparents, not connected to Judaism, not connected to his family, only had his father and Mitzrayim to teach him. And Menashe was big and powerful, but Ephraim prospered in Torah and Mitzvahs. Ephraim was a spiritual leader. And Hashem said, you'll be fruitful. You may you be fruitful and bountiful. And in Mitzrayim, in another Gullus, he, 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 he prospered. So I took the two names of Yaakov and Ephraim, a, a grandfather and a grandson, who both prospered, kept all the mitzvahs, kept the Torah of truth, even when they were living in a world of Gullus, to change the world they lived in, to help bring the Mashiach. L'chaim, l'chaim.